Doctors are sounding the alarm about myocarditis, a heart disease that can happen after a COVID infection. It's believed to have caused the death of a 15-year-old boy who contract, contracted COVID last month. Teens are especially prone to myocarditis, which tends to appear one to two weeks after a viral infection. Symptoms to watch out for include sudden breathing difficulties, wheezing, and chest tightness or pain. The doctor told his parents that they would continue trying to save him, but they weren't able to in the end. Last month, the 15-year-old nephew of screenwriter Yue Qingqing Qing became infected with COVID-19. Upon completing his mandatory home care period, he returned to school. On his first day back, he suddenly fainted and could not be resuscitated. The team was just months away from high school when his life was cut tragically short. On Monday, the CECC said he was Taiwan's first case of a teenager dying from COVID. An autopsy confirmed that he suffered from viral myocarditis combined with acute pulmonary edema and cardiogenic shock. He was also still infected with COVID. At present, we are listing the cause of death as myocarditis. Following recovery from COVID, many patients know to watch for long-term symptoms, which include brain fog and forgetfulness. Not many know that cardiovascular problems can flare up in the four weeks following recovery. Doctors say that youth in particular must watch out for viral myocarditis. Once the virus reaches the lungs, there's a chance it can infect the heart, causing the heart muscle to become infected and inflamed. The risk of that is slightly greater among younger people. The chance of myocarditis after vaccination might be between 1 in 50,000 to 1 in 100,000. The chance of it happening after a natural infection is more than 10 times greater. Viral myocarditis typically occurs one to two weeks after the initial infection. After respiratory symptoms have already improved, it can manifest as sudden breathing difficulties, wheezing, chest tightness or pain or other symptoms. Basically, the mortality rate for viral myocarditis is quite high. It's possible for it to result in sudden death and the progression of the condition is relatively fast. Infection with COVID-19 may also increase the risk of heart disease and stroke. Basically, those who were infected are more likely to experience cardiovascular disease, stroke or thrombosis than those who were never infected. Studies show that the rate of heart disease is two to six times greater. As the epidemic continues, the number of deaths among minors continues to rise. So far, COVID has killed 16 children aged 12 and under in Taiwan. Doctors say that patients should be monitored closely even after they make an apparent recovery.